Hello everyone, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to take your design files from Adobe XD and export them into Avacode for developer handoff and inspection. This will work for both PC and Mac users. So here in Adobe XD, I'm going to take a look at some of the uh, artboards I've designed for the iPhone X. And if everything looks nice, I'm just going to go ahead and save everything. And I'm going to jump right into my browser and go to avocode.com. In the top right corner here, since I'm already signed in, I'm gonna go straight to my projects. So on this screen, you can begin adding a new project. I'm gonna name this project Profile UI. And since it was designed for the iPhone X, I'm gonna click on iOS for the platform. I'm gonna create the project. And from here, you can see that you have the ability to drag and drop PSD files as well as uh, design from Sketch and Figma. But you now have the ability to drag and drop in your XD files. So I'm going to go ahead and open up my folder, find that um, file and drag that in. And it'll begin importing all the designs, all the artboards that you've designed uh, within Adobe XD. So now that all the artboards have been uploaded, I'm gonna go ahead and open up the project to take a look. All right, so it looks like all nine of the artboards have been uploaded here. And I'm gonna go ahead and open up one of these to kind of show you some of the features of Avacode. And one thing you'll notice here is that on the left side, Avacode has kept all of my layers to view on the left side here so I can kind of go through some of the uh, layer structure. I can also click around on the artboard here to kind of see uh, some of the styles for different uh, design elements. For example, by clicking on this text field, I can see the text field size, the font, the font, the font color, the opacity. And I can do the same for clicking on objects so I can see the corner radius as well as the color or gradient. And if I want to export this object, I can click on this button here for exporting or I can double click it and that would take me to the export screen. Now from here, I can export things uh, for, rather I can export this shape in different sizes. So 1X, 2X, and 3X. I can also export it in different formats, such as PNG, JPEG, and SVG. Also on the right side here, I can click on this code icon to kind of see what code is generated uh, for this um, for the square and by clicking around I can copy different code snippets and if I want I can copy all of them by clipping by clicking on the copy all button I can also change the code that's generated to uh, Android or CSS there's actually 10 different coding languages uh, available from Avacode which is pretty great there's also a few tools they can use on the left side here for example, the measurement tool allows me to click on uh, any element and kind of measure the distance between that and itself. There's also the color picker tool so you can sample colors on the artboard. And those colors will be saved up top here. And you have the ability to slice different, uh, uh, I guess, sections of the page. What's also great is that you can share your designs or show your entire file uh, to different members of your team by clicking on the share button here. And from there, they can leave comments to uh, suggest different things uh, to change on your uh, design screens. So Avocode is a pretty uh, useful tool. And what's great is that this works directly from your browser and there's no need to download any app, though there is an app for Avocode. You can simply do it from your browser and there's no need to download uh, a plugin to work between Avocode and XD. As you saw, you can simply uh, drag and drop your files in and just go from there. And as I said before, uh, this feature is available for both Mac and PC users. So if you're on PC, you have this great option to use to have your designs exported for developer handoff. 
So if you enjoyed this video, definitely leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.